I had never heard it. I had known it, but I'd never seen it written, and I was very impressed. I had been studying metaphysics in other arenas for 10 years, and I was teaching it at that point, and it was true. I loved the tapes. It was such a clear, profound, practical message, and gave me an easy uh, new language of metaphysics to speak with the students that I had. I read the first three chapters and I said, how did somebody else know this stuff? I went home and I did full immersion. Um, I got on the weekly tape program right away and ordered the books that were available at the time. From there I listened to the introductory tapes and my mouth landed on the floor. I said, this is amazing. And it just took me, it swept me up. I said, there's something incredible about this. And so I followed it up. I wanted to make this philosophy a, a life practice. I did a search and I found a group on the internet which was discussing uh, the work. The, the processes particularly were meaningful to me and I found that I could do them myself and get a great deal out of them and I could do them with other people. It was an incredibly cohesive community uh, steeped in the work and the love of it and uh, it was an experience of my life. Within a month I, I met some of the people who were the original founders of the Abraham List on the internet and hooked into that and at that point there were fewer than a hundred people on the list. The owner of that list was uh, became a friend and, and he was ready to let it go. He had it for a couple of years and he gave it to me and that was in 1998. Uh, where I created the list that exists today. I wrote on the list every day um, and, and uh, became one of the teachers on the list very quickly because I was listening to so many tapes. I was able to share information that had come from Abraham that uh, other people weren't hearing at that time. Uh, it is this discussion list which is based on the work and very uh, on topic, focused to the topic of it uh, without advertising and uh, it's a uh, uh, a beautiful, beautiful thing. Anyone throughout the world can access it. Um, the, uh, the information is very simple to get to it. Uh, the, it's the online community uh, built as a service, a labor of love. We had expanding across the country and across the world as the internet grew more and more people were asking questions um, on how to get a hold of Abraham. There's frequently asked questions, there are uh, processes, workshop notes, there's any number of things. Abraham Singles is there uh, and there have been a marriage from that. Uh, it's an uh, interesting read. Uh, there's numerous resources on that website. I was in a city where Abraham came twice a year and then I started traveling around following Abraham with my husband uh, who I met through Abraham and so it, it, our whole life has revolved around Abraham basically. It is the the online community. It's a fan club website uh, for the people that love the work and love Jerry and Esther. The people who are in India and um, in Singapore and in Korea and, and Australia and New Zealand, they are on the internet with us and they tell us what it means to them to have this information. Um, there's a woman from Namibia in Africa who has been on the Abraham list for like eight years and are, she doesn't know another soul in the world uh, that she's ever met in the physical who knows this stuff but she's able to practice it and be part of it and so uh, we know that each of the ones we physically know are just a tiny microcosm of all of the people who are out there uh, across the world this philosophy is really getting out internationally and it's really exciting. I feel so completely fortunate to be where I am in this work. I've been in it nine years uh, to try to get the word out and I've done that worldwide and it is a match to the best people in the world. It is a match for the best most delicious way of putting things you know and I tell you it's a gift it's the greatest gift that I know of as far as a teaching goes you know, it's, it's, not, it's a way more than a teaching. It's, it is a way of life. It is a way of thinking and living and being and vibrating and waking up and going to sleep. It's a way of relating to others. It's a way of knowing within your, within your soul how good life is. 
you know, and how great it is, how much, how much beauty there is in the world. It's a, it's a way of appreciating what appreciation does, you know, and the, the lessons of the law of attraction are perfectly presented in this work. You know, there's, there's nothing quite like it. I could go on and on about it. There's, there's no end. I thought it was going to be short, but no, it just pours through. The appreciation is there. And um, I feel it. I feel it from others. I feel it from everyone that it's connected with this work. They're the best people on the planet. I just love it. I love it. And I feel loved. And I guess that relationship between, you know, knowing people that are just, a, just cool people and funny people, happy people, and, and being loved by them, it's family. And it's so much fun. It really is. Yeah, I live for it. It's great.